Hello, I'm Marcy Williams, Vice President of Safety and Risk Management for Texas Health Resources. Uh, we recently have been working on a project, the WHO Surgical Checklist, uh, in order to reduce our complications, our morbidity and mortality. Um, in working with the OR Copic, they came up with a wonderful idea, a visual, to ensure that we've completed the checklist prior to incision. What they came up with is what's called the Patient Safety Checklist. And as you will see, it will have all the elements of the WHO Surgical Checklist. We, we will be refining this to what we've agreed upon. And when a patient comes into the OR, they all start on the red, meaning nothing's been done. And then as we have completed, as we should, then we will move the sliders over to green. And by the time that the incision occurs, all of the sliders should be on green. Now, sometimes implants available may not be that particular procedure, but again, we've addressed it. Um, and so it's important that we'll have hit all the elements for a patient to ensure that the WHO surgical checklist has been completed.